Josh Hustis is bringing back the Montana Elite Invitational after last year's inaugural event proved to be a success. The MEI is an opportunity for some of the top basketball players in the state to expand their recruitment. Last year was great, you know, the first one, um, we had great athletes in the building, had a lot of colleges come through to watch, we got great support from fans. It was a lot of fun, you know, to be able to give back to the kids, give them an opportunity to compete, uh, give them a lot of gear, you know, there were new friendships that were made, a lot of players got better, it was a great time, we had a blast. This year's roster is made up of 28 boys and 28 girls selected from all over the state. Rosters will be a combination of players from all four high school classifications. If we could take 100, we would, right? We would love to. Uh, but, you know, we just, I work with a uh, committee of coaches uh, and journalists and basketball experts from around the state, and we meet and we nominate players throughout the year, and then at the end of the year, we vote. College coaches will be in attendance and have the opportunity to speak directly with the athletes, and other coaches have committed to tune in virtually. Division one can't be there in person, but just for reference, like I've already gotten multiple Division ones from all the way from schools in Hawaii to schools in North Carolina that have already said that they're going to be watching virtually on the live stream. And then in person, I've got uh, NAIA D3 and D2 all wanting to be in attendance, not only from Montana, but from Washington, Oregon, Idaho, a lot of different places. As the Montana Elite Invitational continues to have success, Houston has high hopes for what it can become in the future years. For me, the, the goal is to keep growing and expanding, and eventually I would love for this to be the basketball event in Montana. Um, obviously, you know, there's the hit, there's the Montana-Wyoming game, things like that. I think that we are in a separate uh, category, right, and something that I think can be really, really special um, in terms of what it provides for the athletes and for the fans and for, you know, the players from a recruiting perspective. The event will be held at the University of Providence beginning May 25th and concluding on the 27th. It will be open to the public on the 26th and 27th. Tickets can be purchased starting April 25th on JoshHustonsFoundation.com. I'm Dante Williams with MTN Sports.